Puyallup County Sheriff's deputies are training for a situation they hope they will never actually face. We have an intruder at Pueblo West High School. Deputies conducted an active shooter drill at Pueblo West High School this morning. More than half a dozen agencies were involved. KRDO News Channel 13's Michelle San Miguel shows us what the drill or shows us takes us inside for the worst case scenario. Dozens of students running out of Pueblo West High School. Sheriff's deputies wanted this active shooter drill to look and feel like the real thing. We have a, a, an extreme need to practice. Uh, we need to train to these scenarios. Deputies were told there were possibly three shooters inside the school and they also had explosives. We were trying to show uh, you know, some pipe bombs, some uh, tripwire type explosive devices that were placed by the assailants in the schools and how our first responders would deal with that. Deputies were high-fiving students after the drill, but the sheriff says deputies and school administrators learned a big lesson during this pretend scenario. When they evacuated a piece of the school, it had been uh, wired for explosives and, and so it had not been checked or diffused. So, I mean, that was obviously uh, a bad uh, a bad scenario. I'm here inside the incident command post. Now, while the drill was going on, sheriff's deputies and District 70 administrators were here watching this school surveillance video, communicating with deputies inside the school via these radios, telling them what action plan they should take. You know, you're never as prepared as you as you want to be, ever. And that's why we do drills like this, to become better and better prepared. Will we make mistakes in this drill? Absolutely. Learning from their mistakes, but hopeful this will never be more than a drill. In Pueblo West, Michelle San Miguel, KRDO, News Channel 13. And the Sheriff's Office has been conducting shooter drills at schools for about three years now.